Well, it happened. Popeyes is doing Thanksgiving, but you may want to think twice about trading in that spicy drumstick for a meaty turkey leg. Turkey and Thanksgiving remain linked together in a seemingly unbreakable bond. The good thing about turkey is that it's large enough to feed many people, but the downside is that it can be difficult to prepare. The turkey itself takes up a large amount of oven space, and there's a lot of prep time with the basting and stuffing. While some people enjoy roasting a turkey and the challenge that comes with it, for many, it's just not practical. As families become smaller, for example, a large Thanksgiving turkey doesn't really make sense. Plus, for the time poor, it's an unnecessary burden that's easily replaced with a pre-cooked bird. Whether pre-cooked or not, though, turkey prices are soaring for a number of reasons, including supply chain issues and inflation, reports the Wall Street Journal. And unfortunately, the Thanksgiving turkey price news just keeps getting worse, even for birds cooked away from home. I think we're going to go for chicken this year. One Reddit user took to the platform to share their surprise over the price of Popeye's pre-cooked Cajun-style turkey. Seeing their post titled, I know inflation's messing every everything up, but holy hell, and the photo of a Popeye's Cajun-style turkey with the price tag of $94.99, you might understand the Reddit user shock. It's available online through the website, The Cajun Fix, and feeds between 8 and 12 people, which, for 10 guests, works out to around $9.50 per head. One Reddit commenter noted that shipping is included in the price of the turkey, pointing out that the heavy bird's need for a big box and dry ice could be behind the high cost. The original Reddit user agreed with their theory, writing, "'Last year, I bought it for 50 bucks, and I picked it up locally.'" Another concurred, saying, "'Correct. It's much cheaper in a restaurant.'" Shipping costs aside, the Popeye's turkey dinner's average price of $9.50 is comparable to specials from other restaurant chains. Cracker Barrel is offering a fully cooked Thanksgiving meal for $149, or about $14.90 per head for 10 people. This deal, however, includes dressings, sweet potato casserole, sides, and two pies along with the turkey. As usual, though, the most cost-efficient Thanksgiving option is to buy a fresh or frozen turkey and cook it at home. The average price of a frozen 16 to 24 pound butterball turkey is $1.18 a pound at Walmart, while its cooked options feed 4 to 6 and cost around $24. Here's how Popeyes describes its bird. Our turkey is marinated with our signature blend of Louisiana seasoning, slow roasted, and then flash fried for a crispy coating. It's also important to reheat it according to the instructions. Popeyes recommends letting it thaw in the fridge for three days before baking it in foil at 375 degrees Fahrenheit for one and a half hours, followed by a further 30 minutes without foil to help it stay crispy. You can also reduce the cooking time to keep the bird from drying out. Popeyes originated in Louisiana, so the fast food chain knows a thing or two about Cajun flavors. If you've ever been to this southern state, you'll know that they do things differently than the rest of the country. Flavors and dishes are inspired by the Arcadians, who came into the area in the early 19th century from Nova Scotia. Dominant Cajun flavor profiles include paprika, parsley, garlic, thyme, and black pepper. You can expect a number of those to show up on the Popeyes turkey. As for how the Popeyes Cajun turkey tastes, insider writer Irene Jung hosted a very Popeyes Friendsgiving back in 2019. While her guests felt the turkey was tender and full of flavor, they were more impressed with the stuffing and drippings. So if you're after less headache in the kitchen and something out of the ordinary, Popeyes Cajun turkey might be just the thing you need.